Hey crafty people, it's Rena. Today's Sunday and I wanted to show you what I worked on this morning. I got up about 5.30, um, very slowly got up at 5.30 and um, I had purchased this, I don't know what it's called, but I guess it was like a little planter because this was supposed to have flowers in it. This top part was metal, like a, like a metal roof to the, I don't know whatever it was. Um, anyway, I had purchased this. It was on super special at Michael's marked like 80% off. Um, and I wanted to alter it for a rise house. And what I had thought was, um, well, actually I don't want to take the credit for it. I, I kind of had an idea, but Savannah was actually the one who was like, you need to alter that. And then after Rye gets her mail from her mailbox and she reads her mail, then she can store her mail in this container. So that's what I did. So on the back, it has these um, hangers. So it's meant to hang on the wall. So the first thing that I did was I layered all these laces on the back. And I used a whole bunch of laces and trims that were sent to me to use for altering Rye's house. And then I added some, um, some scraps that I had from uh, my Trezor's Deluxe uh, design team packages. There were some pieces left over. So like I said, it's a combination of, of both um, the gifted items, just layers and layers and layers of lace back here in the back. Um, and then these two pieces with the bows, I cut from some Trezor's um, <clears throat> real gorgeous trim that I had in my stash. And then back here is a Trezor's, a large Trezor's lace, and this is a Trezor's lace um, layered on top. And then underneath, when the house is on the wall, this is a pretty lace that was um, gifted. Um, this past week for use in altering as um, this was gifted a week or so ago and then this is some leftover Tresor's lace and then this <clears throat> was actually gifted to me a while back from um, Sybil B. She had sent me a rack and it had this pretty um, <clears throat> just barely mint um, leaves and pink flowers with some little um, bling centers. Um, this was something that had was gifted to me and in my stash as well. And um, so I did just lots of layering. I used more of those appliques from Miss Sybil B up here on the top of the house. And then I had purchased this welcome sign for Rise House. And obviously I was I wanted to do a wreath on the outside of the house, but I decided to put it on top of this. Um, so I first I spray painted it and then I dabbed it with um, wall spackle and I sprinkled it with um, different types of frontage and frontage flakes. And then I layered, um, these are well, also, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> these were also gifted. Um, for altering for Rye's house and I cut this up it came in a on a strand and I cut it up and tucked it in with the flower clusters um, I had these two little birdies in my stash that I picked up at um, Hobby Lobby and Rye loves birds I mean she super loves birds um, so I wanted to do that I layered some more laces there's uh, another Trezor's lace uh, at the very bottom underneath everything. And then <clears throat> across here on the sides, more Trezor's lace. Under here, I have a few more flowers tucked in the corners. And then <clears throat> I added these um, netting bows, and this netting was... Um, was gifted for um, use in creating um, from one of Rye's fans. And then I had this um, Angelica's Little Scrap Shop um, 
butterfly in my stash and I had a butterfly applique that I just layered back behind it and so it looks like it's actually flying because I put it at the top of the L there. So that is where Rihanna is going to store her mail that she receives from her fans. I love how it turned out. I wanted it to be super, super shabby, and I think I managed that. All right, let me know what you guys think. Thanks for watching. Happy Scrappy Days. Bye.